So it's Lemlist and Snov. Personally, I use Snov. Now, what are they? Uh, Lemlist and Snov are essentially B2B cold email outreach automation tools. So what they do is, is they connect directly to either your G Suite, right, or to your other email provider. And they automate the emails going out with a certain timeout in between. You select the timeout, so how many messages you want to send per day. Lemlist allows for 100 messages per day per domain. I think it can be boosted to a certain number as well. And Snov allows up to 2,000 emails, dom emails per domain, as long as your domain can take it. So G Suite has a limitation of 2000 emails per day but you want to stay under that so you want to test 400 then you want to test 600 then 1000 then 2000 etc uh because if you just go for 2000 straight as soon as you open up a g suite forget about it essentially so lemlist or snov b2b cold email outreach automation you can see the the different uh, essentially the different platforms here this account was on a free trial and now it's about to be deleted because i moved to snov essentially the same so lemlist also gamifies the whole process they have like their sent opened clicked buddies to be made bounced etc and then snov is just more straightforward the thing that i like about snov and before we get into that the pricing so 29 that's like the standard one where you have the single email email warm-up pretty important and then a b testing teammates blah 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 and then snuff pricing i'm currently on the small one essentially and i'm running four email accounts directly from the small one itself five thousand unique recipients which means that you can send five thousand emails monthly right and with snuff you don't have this limitation but the limitation is in the platform itself with regards to what the allowance is and um the just the, the different differentiations here with snuff it's just so much easier to add and manage the different emails of either your teammates or your different aliases 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 whatever um it's like a single click and touch with lemlist it's like uh, you need to contact customer support it just wasn't so easy for me so that's why i migrated to snuff because like i've got four emails here under one subscription and they're essentially sending up to five thousand unique emails per month essentially super simple super easy it's like a one-click type of thing but um the reason as to why lemlist is still pretty cool despite the fact that you're not able to add and manage the emails just like that is lemworm essentially and lemworm what lemworm does is it warms up an email domain before it begins sending so you're able to actually maximize the the like the the capacity of how many emails you're able to send per day directly with lemworm and maintain a domain reputation that's like above a certain point just maintain it over the long term which is super important directly in email marketing because your domain reputation basically means everything with regards to email deliverability if your email deliverability is low whether it's for b2b or b2c email outreaches it's like you never sent the emails in the first place so email deliverability is always like step one in email marketing and lemworm supports that at the end of the day so if your deliverability drops if you're landing in spam put the domain under lemworm let it run for a little bit let it warm up again and then bring it back out as opposed to purchasing another domain setting up the whole thing etc so pretty important and additionally of course pretty important i think lemless can basically innovate a little bit on this segment with regards to adding and managing numerous domains and i think snuff can also add the lemworm feature but at the time i'm using snuff at the end of the day